going on guys welcome back to another video um, I was legit just working on the E90 switching the oil because I haven't switched the oil in forever it was nasty black I have no idea why I waited so long to do that oh my camera's not focusing anyways um, so I just did that I changed the oil that's good um, and last night when I was literally just editing this video you guys are just watching I felt like it wasn't like really connecting, like it just didn't make sense. So I'm making this short video kind of explaining of what's going on. So it is a reaction video, right? I have three videos for you guys. All three videos I'm running MHD Stage 2 Plus, or Stage 2, I don't think there's a Stage 2, it's just a Stage 2. Um, so the car should be around, according to MHD, I think it was like 430 or something like that. Uh, it's pretty decent amount of power. I like how it kicks in. On the second video, the middle video, where uh, I show the reaction of my cousin in the back and his girl in the front, um, I am running an E25 mix. So the difference between the stage two, stage two and the E25 mix is only about like 10 horsepowers. So if you guys don't know, an E25 mix is basically a mix of a uh, of E85, right? So you get a little um, semi E85, you get 91 pump gas, and you basically get those extra 10 horsepowers. It's not a lot, I don't think it's that noticeable. I, I don't think you could tell 10 horsepower, right? But um, basically on a full tank of gas, I put 3.4 gallons of E85 and 12.20 gallons of 91 just to fill it all up, right? And run the E25 mix uh, tuned through the MHD application. Um, so that was the middle video. The first one and the last one, I'm just running the stage two. Um, and if you guys don't follow on social media, you guys probably don't know because I don't think I talked about it in the other videos, but I am running a VRSF um, downpipe, I am running a VRSF uh, intercooler, a racing intercooler, um, and a charge pipe in order to handle all those, uh, the larger amount of boost pressure that I'm pushing out, right? Because I believe my research, right, um, if it, on the stock 435, you're like at 7 PSI, um, right now it's pushing around 21, um, so... I don't have a custom tune yet. I am working with Wedge Performance and Pure Evo Tuning, seeing who I go with right now. I'm kind of in the middle, kind of indecisive. Uh, the main difference with Wedge Performance, um, he's a really cool person, but I also feel like they're just um, not making it as personal as Pure Evo Tuning. Wedge Performance kind of sent me out the list. They're like, here's the, here's the pricing, here's what we can do for you. Whenever you're ready, send me all your, uh, your information of the car and we'll get it done. And I'm like, well, nice and easy you know um, pay the money get the tune and just sync it right just put it through the MHD and just do the custom tune and right now with the MHD stage 2 I guess what's going on I, I still have to do a little bit more research right so I guess it's it's pushing the PSI right pushing the, the pushing the boost and I guess it reaches the 21 which is max boost and it just kind of dies all the way out so it's boost 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 21 and then boom dies out what the wedge performance and pure evo tuning are going to do for me is all that boost is going to reach 21 and they're going to be able to hold that 21 mounts of uh, psi of the boost um a little bit more through the power band right um without me having to upgrade my turbos yet so that's basically what the custom tune is going to do for me i am looking for it but that's going to be for another video so if you guys haven't followed me on social media please follow me on social media uh instagram underscore brian Salas underscore um, that would probably be the best way if you guys do want to see do you want to follow up with the build either with the E90 or with the um, F32. Alright guys, so just enjoy the video. That was just a small little clip of me talking, kind of explaining where the build is right now because I don't think I've explained it before in the past videos. And yeah, just sit back, chill, enjoy this reaction. It's like a roller coaster, huh?
Yeah. You can bring it right. down. The thing has a couple. I'm already recording. Oh. It's recording? Yeah. Alright, cool. right, bye That's bye. Not. That's cool. Oh, it's Brian. I brought down the whole thing. What the fuck? <laughs> you don't bring down the whole thing. <laughs> My bad. Oh, okay. There's the cup holder. Have you heard when it like pops like crazy or something? might blow up like I'm dead ass serious. Well then get me yeah. out of here. Big circle. You actually want to hear it from outside? Like her reaction wasn't as funny as my aunt's. I'm gonna see if I can take out my aunt right now. See if, like, cause her reaction is just fucking priceless. She was just like, whatever. But look at what I fucking got already. A check engine light. I'm gonna put in the scanner later when I get home. See where like, what it is. But like, what the fuck? Like I've only like taken care of it. I don't even push it. <laughs> right, Alex? I don't even push it at all. One sixty five. Yeah, food. Anyways, it's I'm gonna let her drive. Burned. It is burned. It really does smell like it's burned. You're gonna get the camera. All right. Tell me when, Alex. Does this put out flames or something? It could. Dude, but it will next month. <laughs> Alright, go for it. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Alright, hey, honestly, like, if you guys hear it, like, like in person, that's just fucking loud. Anyways, I'm gonna let my cousin drive this shit real quick. Right, see how she does. Hopefully she doesn't wreck it, cause... Cause fuck. Oh, this is like one of the very few times I've been like a passenger in my own car. Let's see how it feels, like running the stage two. You know what'd be funny? What? Actually, I'm not gonna jinx it. No, yeah, don't even say it. Wait, 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 before, before like you actually start, do you know how to drive this? Like it, it's like your dad's car. Like yeah, you put it in drive, right? Mhm. Mm put it in drive. Yeah, right. Swipe it, cause you're gonna drive with the pedals. Pedals. Right? You know. Oh wait, what the fuck? <laughs> no. Okay. No, th there's no, there's no clutch. It just, it's just pedals. So watch. Okay. Uh, turn the wheel like spray it for it. Yeah. Uh -huh. So this is, it's you're in first gear, right? Yeah. When you reach the power band, when you reach like, like six. Where's six, the NOS at? <laughs> what the fuck? When you reach six RPM, six you shift. RPM. You push. You see? Number two. Number three. And then you go down to one, right? Okay. I'm gonna tell you how to shift. If you can't, if you feel like you can't shift, just let me know and I'll do it for you. Should I just turn around? Then? Yeah, just make a U-turn. Oh yeah, you need to back it up. So flip it back. Put yeah. the yeah, keep going. Oh, 
full throttle. I don't want to do Just go full throttle. Okay, stop. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. That shit was scary. Oh, fuck. I like driving it more. Oh, fuck. That shit hella scared me. I thought you were literally gonna eat shit right now. Uh, Wait, we did it. That shit was fucking scary. <laughs> Just keep going, yeah, just keep going straight. How do you feel, Alex? It feels fucking fast. My minivan's faster though. Your minivan? Your supercharged minivan's faster? Supercharged, supercharged, whatever you buy, I have it. What the fuck? <laughs> Imagine that's a cop. We get pulled over. I would have shit. You get a fat ass ticket, <laughs> like right, like where, right where I live, two houses down. There's like a, there's like a, a, there's literally like police like officers. Right there. <laughs> and I swear to God, every time I turn on the car and they're out there, they just look at me and I'm just like, fuck. One of these days, they're gonna fucking, they're gonna get me. I swear, they're gonna get me. They're gonna, they're gonna just stop right there, wait for me to get home, and boop boop. Like I already know, I already know. Fuck it. I'm gonna do burnouts right Back now. Fuck it. Nah, you're not. The only thing you're gonna not for real, like. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking go eco mode because I don't fucking trust you on this. What's eco mode? Like it, it shuts down one va one one of the valves in the exhaust, so it makes it a lot quieter, and it stops the popping. Like, don't get me wrong, it's still hella loud, but it's nowhere compared compared to like the the open valve. That's just pretty loud. For oh yeah. You can go straight. It's cool. And as you guys can see, I took off that um, Gregory Gray or Nardo Gray, whatever you guys want to call it. Through uh, I got it from Vivid, right? As you, as I showed you guys literally on the like a video ago, um, I rocked that gray for about a month, and then it started peeling because I didn't wrap it correctly on the sides. I didn't fold it enough, so it started peeling. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna I'm done with this wrap. I'm gonna take it off. Next wrap, I'm gonna do so much better. Um, so I just took it off. I'm rocking it black, and it looks kind of good on black I'm kind of digging the black because that's gray I don't know if you guys have noticed but it's literally all over challengers chargers Mustangs have them now you literally see it every single car I've seen like two Hondas now rocking that same gray so I'm like you know what this isn't this isn't it is a nice gray it does stick out like when it's super nice and clean but it's not something I kind of want to rock anymore so I'm rocking the black I'm definitely gonna wrap it pretty soon but I'm just kind of debating what kind of color I want I'm um Siding more with like a Tiffany blue, um, either that or a diamond red, um, either or. I'm going to see right now, but I just kind of want to let you guys know that it's not gray anymore. It's black, as you guys saw from the clip that I just inserted because I didn't want to throw anybody out, but uh, yeah.